The newest member of the NBC 25 News team joins us live in downtown Saginaw at the Castle Museum. That's Ilse Lujan Hayes. Good morning, Ilse. Good morning, Joel. We are at the Castle Museum, as you mentioned, in near downtown Saginaw. Now, we'll get to those Arthur Hill students in just a second. First, here to tell us about this amazing building is Lisa McCartney. Good morning, Lisa. Good Thanks morning. for joining us. Absolutely. Now, tell us about the displays here. We have a lot of displays right in this area, our alcoves, and we have some of the um, natural resources that um, helped establish Saginaw. And we have lots more. We have a HO model railroad exhibit down in our... And that's the one that we're looking at right here, right? Right, the coal. Yep. Tell us quickly about this one. Uh, coal mine started in the early 1900s, and Saginaw was a big um, moneymaker for those who owned the coal companies and then um, was good employment for those workers in the area. But all of them shut down in the uh, early 50s. The mines are still there, of course, not safe, but they're still under Saginaw. Okay, now Lisa, let's go ahead and meet those Arthur Hills High School students. Let's introduce them once again to Mid-Mission. Again, come on, head over. Now, the students are right over here in this room. They are so excited about their displays. Um, we interviewed them throughout the morning, and we are so proud of you guys. We're going to talk quickly to your teacher, really quick, 10 seconds. Tell us about the display. This is our first annual social studies fair, 100 displays. The kids worked really hard, and we'd like to thank Meyer on Titabawassee Road for a wonderful contribution to this, and the Castle Museum for their uh, help as well. Terry Mativa, wonderful job with these students. I bet there's a lot of proud parents out there. Your displays were beautiful. And if you want to check out their displays, they will be um, here at the Castle Museum near downtown Saginaw starting today through Sunday. Admission is only a dollar. Come on down. For now, we're live in Saginaw. Ilse Lujan Hayes for NBC 25. Good for you, Ilse, and welcome to our news team, Ilse Lujan Hayes in Saginaw.